Hi, I'm Liz Neuschatz. I'm the executive director of the PetFinder.com Foundation. We are here in Guthrie, Oklahoma on our rescue U trip at the city of Guthrie Animal Shelter. The shelter was completely destroyed on May 24th, 2011. With the generous support of the Animal Rescue Sites Gifts That Give More program, we were able to come down here with students from four different colleges and universities to lend a hand. These dedicated kids gave up their winter break to come down and help us out, and they came from all over the country. We have students from Oklahoma State University, both their undergraduate and vet school students, University of Oklahoma, Delaware Valley College in Pennsylvania, and Montgomery Community College in Pennsylvania. Guthrie? Animal Shelter, you guys all know, but just for posterity's sake, hit by an F5 tornado May 24th. They have double buildings. Um, it looks kind of strange now. That building behind you guys was left completely intact. Kind of a weird, you know how tornadoes are. Strange what they come and take. This building here is actually new construction. This building houses the office and it was their cattery. So this whole thing was destroyed. Um, cats all went who knows where, you know. They were able to recover most of their cats, but they all survived and lived, and a lot of them actually got adopted out because you know how people are. Boy, you hear a sad story, and they came out of the woodwork and took all the cats home. So it worked out real well for those cats who were completely traumatized. They were able to get some FEMA money to rebuild the outer shell structure and do some stuff on the inside. The FEMA money wasn't enough, so we're here to help them do this. When I first got here, I got off the plane, and we went and rented a massive truck and a U-Haul and went to Lowe's and went shopping. We picked up a bunch of lumber, a lot of other tools that we needed because we knew we'd have a lot of people here. Then we had to come here and unload everything, find a safe place to put it, kind of get a layout of the area, figure out what work we'd be doing, how we can assign projects to people, um, setting up equipment, laying out where the new fences will go, also installing a new roof over the kennels to protect the dogs from the elements, and trying to tornado proof whatever we can tornado proof for the next time. So what you doing? Digging a hole. For what? To set the post to make a new roof over these kennels. Oh. Okay. So they have some protection from the sun, the rain, the wind. Yeah. How deep do you have to dig it? Probably about 18 inches, maybe two feet. Yeah. And do it on both sides? Yeah. Yeah. This side, and then another one on the far end of the roof or the building. Right. You look tired. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the beginning. Yeah. This gate is going to be the door that will go into one of the exercise pens. 
and this is the entrance, this is the hallway, and they can come out the back from the kennels and go into the exercise pen. And there's going to be three exercise pens? Or? Yes, we're going to have two in the back here, one's going to be on the side. Cool. We have to clear this so we can dig a little, like a trench along here so we can fill it in with uh, pea gravel and then build a level. Uh -huh. And then what's going there? Just a garage. A garage. And why does this have to move? Just because, see how underneath here, this is 14 feet 5 inches. Mm -hmm. So this, have to, this is the, uh, the end of the garage is right there. Oh, I see. Yeah. <laughs> so unfortunately it has to move half a foot yeah, yeah. or so. Uh, more than half. Yeah, so you got to get around there to screw the... Like a foot, so... Well, and I just saw you guys trying to see if you can leverage it and it wasn't moving. Uh, What's the plan? They're going to get a backhoe or a forklift to push it because it's got it's bolted to uh, I-beams underneath. Oh, okay. And unfortunately, they're all running this way, so... Right. And when we tried to lift it, it's, it's fiberglass. It's <laughs> just cracking. Fun. Rescue U has changed my life because it's given me the opportunity to help other people hands-on and actually see the effects of what I'm doing and be able to physically, I don't know, experience what people go through in different areas, understand why they do things and what they need help with and spread the word, educate other people. Stay tuned, follow us on PetFinder.com and see the great work that we do.